Hello, this is Seamus and 7MYW. I have been watching a lot of the new videos about uh, the D75 and boy, the release of that amazing radio has made me really um, dive back into my D74 a lot more. So I thought uh, I'd play around a little, a little bit more with it. And one of the things about this radio I forgot about was the, uh, the ability on APRS to pull up your local weather station. There's a lot of the weather bots out there that uh, will give you up-to-date and current weather conditions for where you're at, or they'll give a weather forecast for your region. And it's really, really simple to do, and this will work on the on both the Kenwood D74 and 75 as well as some of the other radios that do APRS, like the Yaesu brands. But this particular one here is quite simple to do. So I'm going to show you how to do this real quick. I've got the... Uh, Got this hooked up to an external antenna on APRS right now, but primarily what you do is you look down here in number four and you see that it says new and message. So hit the F key to do a new message. It takes you to the line that says two. So you hit the middle button, two, and you just use these keys and do WXBOT, weather bot. So you do W over X B. O T and then when that's done you hit enter then you go down to message text oops go down to message text hit enter that allows you to type whatever and then just do today T O D A enter now you notice that uh, that it says that you can send back so you want to change it so we're gonna hit send now let's see what happens. So it sent the message. W X B O T. And there it is. That shows you the two miles north of Van in North Vancouver, and it's going right back to the other. It'll continue sending that message, and if you you can put it on loop to where it will send it. Um, we'll tap this, and there it is, right there. So, shows of the chance of rain, you can just click this and it'll show the entire message. Or you can get local conditions as well. It's a really useful feature, especially if you're in an area you don't know, or uh, you want to get uh, what the current temperatures are for somewhere close to you, or even far away. That is, uh, that is a great feature on these radios for APRS. Just another thing that APRS will do. And this radio, and the D75, as well as uh, the, the Yesu FT3 and FT5, uh, FTD5 and FTD3 both uh, both have amazing APRS capabilities, but I still think that the Kenwoods are the top of the line. Um, it's amazing what you can do with this for APRS, and these are just from the last couple of minutes, as you can see. Uh, pretty pretty impressive what what you can pick up and the things that they'll do. This radio is incredible. Uh, while I would love 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 to have a D75 right now. They're just, a, they're just too pricey for me currently. So I'm using my D74 and just kind of relearning some things that I had forgotten about. So incredible radios. Thank you, Kenwood, for putting them out. Now I can see uh, maybe the price will drop on that D75 and I'll eventually be able to pick one up. So that being said, just wanted to share that with you this morning. Uh, I've not been able to get on and, and produce too many videos lately, but I'm going to try to remedy that the best I can. Thank you so much for watching. It's much appreciated. Uh, I hope that you enjoy these videos. Please uh, give me a thumbs up on there. Let the uh, let the people at YouTube know that you enjoyed this video. Let me know as well. Any comments in the comment line would be appreciated. And um, please subscribe. It doesn't cost anything, and I certainly do not ask for money. So um, let me know what you think. Thank you so much for your time. I'm 73 from Seamus and 7MYW.